if you're watching this video and you have really small storage space do not worry this video is for you tell me i am god sent say hey <laughs> hi guys what's up what's new what's popping <laughs> so welcome to my youtube channel and in case you're new here my name is zach daniel and please do not forget to subscribe yes so thank you very much for supporting me and the launch for the website was very successful zackdaniel.com i tell you yes so we are going to have very 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 many things on the website like the glow i told you i am soon coming up with a skin care whether you have an oily skin a dry skin a rough skin hyperpigmented yeah i am going to sort you out very very soon just Stay tuned, right? So you see the glow, the glow, okay? Yes, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, thank you very much. And yes, thank you for always supporting. So today I'm doing a video on how I usually organize my my wigs or my yeah my hair generally. So most of the time, you usually see me with the matutas, the lines, the whatever's in this. In this channel of mine <laughs> yeah so most of the time i always have lines on my hair so it's because i usually do wigs so in case you see me with with these braids yes you know something has happened so i did okay usually have put on wigs wigs most of the time because wigs first of all they save your money they save your time because I go to the salon i get wigs at not wigs i get um condros i'm a line summer milasso at 200 shillings right so it's been a year since i did braids yes this braids it's been it's been a year i have not been doing braids and soon i am not going to be doing braids because i'm changing i'm getting a braided wig like full lace the one that i'm not i just be doing lines 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 because braids they destroy my hair yeah so i'm going to show you how I usually arrange my wigs but long ago i used to put them like i was really 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 suffering these are my wigs yes these are my wigs so tell me if it were you how would you be arranging these wigs so today i'm going to sort you out this is how i'm going to arrange the wigs and i think i should also educate you on like wigs yeah yes i just down there let me know if you want me to do about wigs because there are different types of wigs because people go to the market they get corn they don't know more about human hair and all that yeah so the reason why i prefer buying human hair it's cause uh it saves you when you try and think and just look and calculate it saves your money even though when you buy it at the first at first you see it's expensive but it is very 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 addictive okay yeah so this is all of them are human hair so i've washed them yeah and see how they are going to this is how it looks this one so i've not done anything to it just brought them out from i just washed them so I am going to show you how I usually arrange them and how I like my house is really small and how I utilize that space just to store them okay so I'm going to also just a little education but in case you want me to do a detailed video of how like hair and so that you can't go get corn in the market as you buy human hair let me know and yeah let me know i sort you out down there comment if you want me to do the same video the vid like a video on the same yeah so this is human hair one of them so i re i washed all of them all of my hair i washed them and yeah so let's arrange i tell i show you how i usually put them together long ago i used to really strain but because i discovered something and i am also selling it to you if you want i can sell it to you at only a thousand shillings yes like this is one of my wigs i sell i have stored it in here so i'm going to show you how easy it is and you can put more and more like maybe two 
in one bag so this is called dust proof wig storage bag and mostly is for people who have small space like me my space is really small so for me to squeeze i have to use this bag okay so you just what you do this one is the hanger you just remove it here and then you open it like this okay here so i just do it do that and then yeah my wig is here so let's put it back to the bag and you can easily i had said this one can fit like two two wigs and they are going for ten dollars or a thousand shillings so since i have this weave or bundle that remained i can do an extension for it then i can also place it here the final look i have added one there and then another one up here so the advantage of this bag is that you're able to save space and then your wigs won't be able to get dust after they are clean yes so that's why i call them dust proof wig storage bag so if you have a small space this one will save you and as well as if you have a big space it won't cause any harm to you here yeah, so i'll do all to the wigs to the rest of the wigs this is just colored bob wig colored yeah colored bob wig it's called mongolian mongolian the one that looks like an african hair mongolian wig yes yeah, so it's a frontal frontal is the same as ear to ear so you when you see a wig has frontal it means that ear to ear okay that's frontal this is straight this is straight eh, name is Shuva Jamain. Yeah, this is yeah, this is straight. Uh, but this one is full lace. Yes, full lace. Full lace is like your head. You can use it as your head. Yeah. So it, they'll just need to be flat ironed or yeah to be straightened just to give them a nice look or nourished or whatever. I'll just do a video on wigs and all that in details this is called kinky kali kinky kali it's a frontal as well i love frontals because they give you a natural look like in like you can put baby hair here yes this one is almost like this one but they are totally different different hairs this one you see the curls are defined and this one is like an afro afro look yes so you can also confuse with this one let me educate you on this one first this one is a 360 degrees wig so 360 means that all around you have a lace the back and the front but the advantage of this is that you can tie it here so it will look so natural when you tie it up so this one and this one they also look the same but they are not the same so this is deep wave deep wave has bigger curls but this one is afro kinky but then you have to maintain them with mousse so that they can define the curls yeah now this one is uh, this is uh, a yeah, kinky straight it is called kinky straight you can also confuse <laughs> with this one but then these are totally big different this one they usually as uh, this one is like a natural hair you see the difference you see this like image kunja kunja or it's like this something this one is completely straight completely this one is kinky straight but i'll educate you don't worry this one and this one are the same just that this one is still new and then this one i've worn it like more than a year now yeah that's why and most wigs here have worn them for a really long time all of them are human hair so this one i've not worn it yet and it's also a frontal yeah so that's the difference so i'm going to pack them so now here are my wigs and i want to hang them where i usually put them usually put my clothes as you can see i also need hangers hey, Germany. <laughs> but poly poly too so i'm going to also hang my my hair here yeah since my space is really small 
generally this is how it looks and the good thing about this is that you can always squeeze them together or if you have too many wigs you can always label here you can always label down here as the paper is transparent you're able to put them there so that's generally how i usually arrange my wigs in this small space of mine yeah and i think that's it for today's video until next time and please don't forget to subscribe like share whatever yeah bora to see rog okay bye bye thank you so much for watching